Hi guys, Pete from Mixcat. Had a lot of emails on uh, making ethanol. I'm going to go into this in a little bit more detail in some uh, up and coming videos. I'll actually show you guys how to make a still and how to make a mash that really gives you a high yield. Um, D. Brannon 79 actually asked me about uh, water. Um, do I boil it with my yeast? I actually do not. Um, I should have got into it in the video, so forgive me on that. Um, I actually use its reverse osmosis water. I have normal city water here, but I do have a reverse osmosis machine. Um, you can make them pretty cheaply, but that gets uh, all the additives out of the water. I do test my water uh, periodically just to make sure I have nothing going on in it, and it's real clean water after that. So basically, um, I add the yeast to the water um, with the five pounds of sugar and five pounds of uh, corn, uh, that's a corn mesa. Um, I roll around that bottle just to kind of mix everything up real good, the yeast, the sugar, the corn. Um, I let that happen for about two days, so it sits in room temperature for about two days. Um, after those two days, I actually do agitate it again, so I shake it up, uh, make sure the uh, water becomes very murky again, and let it sit for another two or three days. Um, after that, it's ready to go. But I'm going to show a video in detail on that. Thanks for the questions. Keep them coming.